Hey guys, it's Monty. And now Monty goes away. So, Cool Man Steve, Kevin VDK, Cool Man Steve, early gang gang. Yeah, four comments. Cool. So, how is Friday coming along? I realized that uh, <laughs> cough. And I was just like, oh my gosh, did I get, you know, the pandemic, whatever's going around now? Because my family, the rest of my immediate family got the cough as well, got a cough. Um, but then we kind of broke it down and realized that we all got coughs for different reasons. <laughs> my kid got a cough because he was screaming all night the other few nights ago. My wife got the cough, got a cough because she was exhausted um, from taking care of a screaming child. And I got a cough for screaming at the Sapphire uh, lens protector. I had to film that video twice. And so I just got so frustrated. I just lost my mind. And I was like editing this video and I realized like I'm cursing so much and my throat got hoarse. Um, which is why, like, I thought I got a cough. I didn't, but eh, here we are. Darren, good. Devyanshu Kumar, hello. Ghost Cow, hello. Hey, man. Hanuman Singh, Walid Rashida. Where is Monty William? He's over there. He doesn't like sitting on me for these things. Colorado, woo. It's very similar where I live to Colorado. Rocky Mountain Range, share the same mountains. Uh, Easy Fit is nice for my iPhone 11, please help. I don't know, is that's not a question, Jeffrey Vardalion. Hey, AEW, Kashida Rai, I appreciate the work. Leave me a little, yeah, productivity in real life. Hey, neighbor, <laughs> Southeast Calgary. I grew up in Southeast Calgary, Willow Park. <clears throat> Lima, Peru, cool. Nice to have you here, Raul Farfan Castro. Or am I going to get the iPhone 12? No. <laughs> uh, so, I think the only thing that kind of, that I read over the last week that was kind of interesting was a rumor that iPhone 12 wasn't going to ship with a charger or uh, headphones. And so at first I was just like, as long as Apple reduces the price accordingly, um, you know, however much the iPhone 12 is going to cost, which probably isn't going to be much more than the iPhone 11 says, if you guys have been watching those videos, I've done the price breakdown and the more stuff that Apple introduces. So like there's an OLED screen that gets introduced and the price goes up, which is understandable because there's new more materials going to that thing. But Apple always takes a, I think, a 30% or 60% profit margin uh, off of materials. So it doesn't include the uh, R&D. And so as long as the iPhone 12 prices go are lower than the iPhone 11 prices because they're missing the ear pods and the charger, then I'm okay with it. And, you know, change is always very, we all don't like change a lot, but it's like, I've got so many sets of ear pods that are unused, just sitting around all over the place. Um, and chargers, especially those tiny five watt chargers. I've, again, same thing, got tons of them around and I don't actually use them because they're only five watt, right? So like I've got, I definitely have the uh, iPad 18 watt chargers going. I've got a bunch of fast chargers just plugged in around all around, all around the uh, house. And so not having those two things, I think isn't going to be a big deal breaker for most people. Will they do that for the iPads? No, I don't think they'll stop selling chargers for the iPads. But um, with the uh, iPhone 12s, you know, it's going to be cheaper to ship because you can fit like two, three iPhones in a, pass, <laughs> a stack like that instead of just one. So that's kind of how my line of thought works with uh, iPhone 12 not coming out with uh, chargers in the comments. What do you guys think? Oh, so many comments. Hey, David, Monsma, Apple Watch, must get. How's the weather up in Calgary? It's so nice today. I'm excited to sit outside and drink beer. Uh, David. Yeah, but, you know, I put it in the same vein as uh, removal of the uh, phone jack, right? It's, <clears throat> it's the same thing. 
Uh, how are you doing? How's my quarantine? How's Monty doing? Carlos, I'm f coming up on uh, the end of the isolation video series. I think we've got 10 more videos left, maybe 12. So that's 120 videos in a span of 120 days ish. One video a day. It's been a grind the last couple of weeks. I'm just going to go grind it out. Uh, Monty's fine. Getting older. He's eating now. Uh, why am I not getting the iPhone 12? I'm being sarcastic. It's not fair that they made those iPhones so expensive, but it's. I don't. More stuff goes into a device, it's going to come. It's just. It's simple dollars and cents. Yeah, true, Ruben. Who <laughs> really needs another charger? Monster. I think it's a good thing that they're removing the headphones here from the iPhone 12. It's true. I think mainly. New yeah, no, you're right. That would actually be kind of interesting if they offer two versions, one version without the charger and another version with, and then the price difference, you know, that, that would be smart. Um, Ghost Cal, so one of the iPhone 11s that I had, the battery started expanding, and the genius guy just looks at me, he's like, you've been using uh, third-party chargers? And I was like, yeah, like. I don't tell the Apple Genius people that I'm a reviewer. I'm just like, yeah, I started using these turns. Like, don't ever use that. It's just like, that's the only explanation he gave to me about um, <laughs> why my iPhone 11 battery started to expand. Uh, Juan Sanchez, got your 11 Pro Max. Nice. Any case recommendations? Go watch one of my videos, like the top 10. <laughs> Uh, Kevin VTK, I don't need any more charge bricks, but I do need more cables since I break them. Yeah, well, that's one of the things I've actually been doing, Kevin, is I've been trying to figure out how to program stuff. So this is a Raspberry Pi. This is a stepper motor. And I'm in the process of trying to figure out how to build something that does this tens of thousands of times. So I can just whack a cable around. And just to see, you know, what the best cable is out there. You know, the anchor power lines, like, we can twist it like 65,000 times. And, like, I really want to find out if that's actually true. So I'm in the process of uh, trying to do that. If you guys know how to do stuff with this Raspberry Pi, like, I'm all ears on how to do stuff. Like, I have a very, very, very basic understanding of programming. I can get through it. But uh, what else have we got? It's four degrees in Toronto. Dang, that's terrible. And it's humid in Toronto too. I have a little. Use a charging your pause. I would feel fine. Pollution of those things so high. I understand. That's a good point, John. What's the best iPhone and when is the worst iPhone? The best iPhone is always going to be the newest one, and the worst iPhone is the one that you're getting rid of. <laughs> David, yeah, I admit reaction was the same to the headphone jack thing, and it's. Yeah, I I I understand it. Um, the one thing that I've been looking for that I haven't quite found is a good set of lightning or USB-C cables. Like, I don't necessarily like having stuff wireless all the time when the battery runs out, but, you know, what can you do? I could, yeah, David, you could just buy a charger at the store or just get, like, a multi-plug brick. Like, this is a... You know, I'll stuff plugged into it. This is a RAV4 fast charger. I just pulled everything. That looks terrible. Just get one of those. Like, you charge so many things with it. Devanishu Kumar, what am I reviewing next? So, we've got the uh, Logitech Slim Folio Pro that's coming up on Sunday. And tomorrow, we're releasing the Mujo leather case. Uh, Wally, what made you want to do a YouTube channel? I uh, lost my engineering company clients figured this was funner started doing it when are they going to release ios 14 a week before they released the iphone 12s interesting to say they would sell the anchor chargers out there yeah well yeah what would be the best case for the iphone for, for a fire for needs to be close to bulletproof um a hit case shield alex <clears throat> carlos yeah, no, uh, I'm trying to figure out what my videos would look like with the testing units. Because I realized a lot of the stuff I do in the background, I don't really film and I don't share with you guys. 
And so, yeah, but we'll kind of get there. It's been a lot of fun. Like I always liked electronics as a kid, which is, you know, maybe one of the reasons why I have a tech YouTube channel, but being able to look at the guts and all the wires and all these things like this is, I wish I just had more time with it, but that'll come after I uh, stop doing a daily review every single day. Uh, David, Amazon basics braided. Yeah. And I think a lot, there are a lot of good cables out there, but I just want to find the best one. Again, I always like figure out what marketing fluff is incorrect. Cool man, Steve. But I'll uh, suggest you update your thumbnail. Watermarks are dull and not much. So cool man, Steve, if you actually go through my channel, you'll see there are a series of different thumbnails that I'm testing. iOS 14 coming out this fall. You only review Apple products for now. Yes, mostly because the accessory market for the iPhone for any sort of iPhone is significantly larger than any accessory market um, for any Android device. Like it's hands down, magnitudes larger. Uh, productivity in real life. Bought my Apple Watch, got my UJ rubber band. Any recommendation for screen protector for it? I've got a video for that productivity in real life. Best screen protectors, definitely check it out. Um, released it right before this pandemic, so earlier this year. What camera do you use to shoot your videos? I use the camera facing stuff is a Sony a6400. Some of the product shots are some of the product shots are on a Sony 7R3 and then the other shots are just on an iPhone. Using iPad as a laptop for students. If you get an iPad with a keyboard, that'd be close to as a laptop. I think it's a good good use of a laptop or of an iPad with a magic keyboard, but it's expensive. And don't, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Do not compromise and get the stupid bridge thing. This is addressed to Philip. I don't know how to say your last name. Kevin, you're trying to program, man. I also try to program what program language you're using. I'm just using Python right now. Um, I grew up on TurboPad, did a lot of C, C plus, and then I own, and then uh, FileMaker has FileMaker's app uh, app stuff I did a while back just has whatever scripting language they have. Do you think Apple will implement Touch ID in the screen? No, I think Sean, I think Apple is done with Touch ID and mobile devices. Face ID works so much better. Rejo George, quarantine going on. We're kind of not in quarantine anymore. Everything's opening up very, very slowly. Savage Crispita, when is the new Rhino Shield 3D review coming? Haha, <laughs> good thing you asked. That's coming out Monday or Tuesday or Wednesday, depending on how long it takes us to film everything. What case are you using right now? I'm using whatever I'm reviewing next, which is the Mujo and the Incipio uh, Organic Core. MK, and it's incredible how much waste could be prevented by Apple, not including charger and earbuds. No. Oh. That's good to know, Anthony. How long does an iPhone last? A decade? Longer? <laughs> a long time. David, what does my wife do for a living? She's an accountant. William? Here's Monty. Michelle, Monty's right here. He's right here. How many YouTube channels do I have? Wally, I have three. Four? Three. Cable lasts, but the contacts at the end get dirty, and sometimes it doesn't charge when it's plugged in. So can you not clean it, Patrick? Take some sandpaper. I've never actually had a cable get that dirty. Uh, an iPad case review, but I can't find it in a separate video. Third eye brick. Um, my current round of favorites is going to be the Mifa ones um, that you uh, that I released on Monday. Uh, there is an Urban Army Gear civilian that I really like. This is the Urban Army Gear Scout, and I don't like it as much, and I don't know why. Uh, how do you get Monty to stay so still in your videos? I just he just I tell him to. Stay get up on the table and like he will literally just sit here for the rest of this uh live stream patrick i never used a uh, microsoft service surface or lenovo yoga like i've had no need to whatsoever so i have no idea nick i'm gonna miss videos every day it's my problem with the videos 
every day is that um oh that's neat two bucks thank you um it's all about executing when i do a video every single day so i think maybe next year like i'll do a quarter where it will be videos every single day but like i just don't have the time to do like the big top 10 videos right like i'm still trying to finish the privacy screen protector one that i started and it's just it takes a lot of effort to do those really big ones and so i need to do those because that's what gets me the most attention on youtube right so i'm producing seven videos a week six plus this a live stream it might go down to four for the next while so it will still be very frequent more than it was before but just not every single day because that's just unsustainable favorite case of all time is going to be a Thule x3 or an x4 how do you get face id to work with the face mask on i don't <laughs> uh, connor tozo t6 those sound like a terrible ripoff of some sort brent mania 89 thank you shout out peace peace heart i don't know i'm not i'm not gangster like that can you give monty a treat don't have a treat down here such a baby that monty yeah he's he's a good one Monty, do any tricks not really no more than the average dog who sits stays rolls over rolls around does circles and he does all those things before he eats so he works will the price of a used iphone drop and gray markings new island will be the same price as the current iphone um i've sold enough iphones mirza that they retain their value incredibly well like i think the last iphone i sold was an 11 pro max and you know i paid 1500 bucks for it i got like 1200 for it right like it, it's crazy like i tr i went and tried android phones a while back i bought a bunch of s7s and i couldn't sell those things for the life of me <laughs> kind of brad dog food do you give your dog um Every meal is a third of these dental kibbles to help clean his teeth. He gets oatmeal and whatever protein, either an egg, chicken, beef, whatever I cook. Will you review older phones now, Sean? No, I won't. Thoughts on HomeKit smart locks that don't only like are all smart locks. Ghost Cal? The only one that comes to mind that doesn't look like a smart lock is the Dana lock. Um, it's smaller than like the stupid August one. It works better than the August one, but I haven't touched any smart locks in probably a year. Like I still have them all installed everywhere, but there isn't one specific lock that doesn't look like a lock. Um, any fitness centers open in Calgary? Yeah, they uh, opened almost a month ago, three weeks ago. I've been going every single day. Uh, Nick M, thumbs up. What is your daily driver? It's whatever I'm reviewing. Maui Tech, review the phone rebel cases. No. Philip, what's my education? I'm an engineer. I have an engineering background. I've got an MBA. Aaron Jacob Greenwald, mention me. Okay, Jacob, I will mention you. I'm very disappointed that I just read the comment without realizing what your intent was because I do not like giving my attention to people who just want attention. Uh, Bangladesh, wow, so far away. How pro do you think the AirPod Pros are? Those AirPod Pros are so pro. The pro thing about the AirPod Pros is that it can professionally connect to all the professional devices that you have, like the iPad Pro and the iPad and the Apple Pro Maxes. <laughs> uh, have you been to Hinton before? I know where it is. I, sure, I have as a kid, but no. What legend would your career be if you weren't doing... <laughs> what would be my career? I'd still be an engineer. I'd be making way more money than whatever I do now. CE10, just watch your native union leather case for their pods. It was great. I have two of them and love them. Just a tip for the bad fit. You have to take it off and put it on and hope it stretches. Yeah, but that's still, the muffin top still exists. <laughs> it's like, then use a hairdryer. Oh, that just sounds terrible. <laughs> How do you spell the watch brand, please? M-I-F-A. Uh, not interested in phone label cases. I haven't gotten them yet. Like, I finally got the shipping notice, but... Will you make your own phone case charger? Yeah, I'm not a sellout. I'm a reviewer. Like, I, my interest in things is to find out if they're worth getting. That's the problem I like to solve. And so 
making my own phone case and then trying to sell it is not, it doesn't line up with what I want to do, right? Because then I am tied to being forced to sell that product. So when I spend tens of thousands of dollars to create this product, I have to push it, right, to make my money back. And that's not, that's not me. I don't want to do that. Uh, no, that's a no. That's an, ah, you know what, Connor? I am actually going to start doing headphone reviews. I'll put that into consideration. Um, what do you guys think about doing headphone reviews where there's a complete teardown of the entire unit? So two videos, one of the actual review and then one of the actual teardown. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, what do you think about the Unicorn Pro cases? Yeah, they're fine. Valentine, they're cheap, um, but they're fine. What's your take on metal bands for Apple Watches? I haven't seen a review for one recently. I just use the Juke ones. The metal bands, I haven't actually used any in the last while. I do have the, uh, <coughs> the only metal band that I have was a Jet Tech stainless steel link one and an actual Apple link one. In that video, like a difference between the real and the fake ones. Um, that's, that video still exists, it's a few years old. Um, what's your favorite spot to travel? I love going to Hawaii. What's the best cases for law enforcement? I want to say metal ones with the hit case shield. Um, Steven. Steven. Headphone idea sounds great. I think, yeah, like I think that would be interesting just to kind of see. Like my, I have an assumption with the headphones is that most of them are made with the same components. That's the base assumption that I have because... There can't be that many different factories that sell that APTX chip. There can't be that many factories that sell um, the Bluetooth chips that go into it, right? And so they all kind of most likely come from the same place. The only difference would be the exteriors. And so that's kind of the assumption that I want to figure out myself. Um, how to become a YouTuber? Any tips for you? Start, do it, and commit to it. Where it's, which AirPods should I get if it's your first pair? Dinesh Kumar, AirPods Pro. How do you actually use any phone cases? Do you actually use any phone case? <laughs> I don't know how to answer that. Uh, Zaziel, yay, lit. What's the best case for an iPad Mini 4? Not a clue. William. Uh... Uh, headphones, Jaziel, any, and Anthony Lopez. I've never worn watches in my life, but I'm intrigued by the idea of a wearable piece of tech like an Apple Watch, but I still don't know what I would actually get use for. Why should I get one? So, Anthony, prior to getting, starting the, uh, getting the Apple Watch a few years back, the last time I had a watch was when I was 13. And so, like, I'm 39, so a span of over 20 years, I didn't use any watches because I found them annoying because... There's a, there was always a clock around, right? And so this thing, with this current iteration, like the health tracking, the heart rate tracking, like you can kind of tell that's like my workout this morning was crazy, right? It tells you to move. It's just makes your, it makes your life, your health, just a tiny bit better. And that, to me, is worth spending, you know, the three, four hundred bucks just so that a tiny little machine tells you stand up every once in a while so that, you know, later on in life, you're not bedridden. You know, simple things like that, I think, is a very powerful thing, um, which is the number one reason to get a uh, Apple Watch. Uh, Joe the Mechanic, what case for the iPad Pro do you recommend? Um, depends what you want to do with it. Give me some more details, Joe the main, 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 Maniac the Mechanic. What are the best budget headphones? I don't know. That's something I'm going to have to find out eventually. Um, how often do you change cases on your phone? Will you like every, like every other hour? <laughs> AirPod, can you talk about Apple Glass? We don't know anything about it, but once it comes out, it's going to be probably pretty good, I think. If Apple can do it, or if... Anybody could do it. Apple could do it right. Uh, David, one kid's good enough for now. Oak and Blue, glad I'm not the only one. Have you tried the Anchor Charger cable? I have one somewhere. I don't like how they're a little thicker 
than the uh, other cables. I think it's kicking around in that pile over there. That's the best case for 50 bucks. Every single case in my top 10 is about 50 bucks. So check that out, Avis Ahmed. Why iPhone, almost all the case manufacturers making. Why iPhone has almost all the case manufacturers. Because people like their iPhones more than they like Android devices. Drawing animation, I'm looking for something slick but durable. Um, sleek but durable. Honestly, the Apple cases by themselves are probably my preference. Mostly because I haven't come across a third-party iPad case that attaches magnetically. Um, I was a really big fan of the Moshi Eye Glaze, but all those really thin iPad cases, they snap a really cheap piece of TPU or polycarbon on the back, and they just become so incredibly annoying to use. Um, so that magnetic, being able to remove it quickly from an, an actual iPad Apple iPad case and then being able to plop it down into a magic keyboard magnetically, like that stuff, that interaction is just so great. Um, but if you do need something, check out my review for the Autobox Symmetry. Symmetry 360 Folio. That's the best case I've used so far that offers a decent amount of protection and can still kind of lay completely flat on the, uh, on the uh, table. Uh, Oh, so many. Sorry, guys. Stephen Ray B. Maybe you can compare technology top selling headphones versus top selling headphones. Yeah, no, I can. Thanks for the idea. Does the iWatch work okay if you wear it reverse on your wrist? Okay, military style. Yeah, no, I work out half the time I work out like that. When is iOS 14 coming out? A week before the iPhone 12 gets announced. Do you still like the Rhino Shield case? I actually do. Um, on the Apple Watch, especially. Um, and then. I like, I've been drawn more to the Mod NXs because of the customization. I do have Reynolds Shields uh, AirPod cases, so that review will come out probably a week, week and a half. Do you have plans of buying the new phone when it comes out? No, I'm not going to buy the new phone. My, my channel is not dependent on me being able to produce content for the latest iPhone. Valentine, like your statement in the Kia about all that pay is getting slots for Apple Pencil. What if you don't want exactly Valentine? Valentine, Valentine. It just, like, I. I don't imagine it would take that much more effort to not produce a case with that part on it, right? Because honestly, writing on an iPad without a paper-like screen protector, that review's coming uh, as well. It's just terrible. It's just so bad. Like, it's just too slick for me anyways. Um, at what age did you get your first iPhone? 28. Speaking of good case option, yeah. No, oh, they are. Rejo. Raul, my friend, do you think tomorrow the rule has discount for iPhone? I'm sure somebody will have discounts. I don't sell cases myself. Uh, I brought my first round shield case because of your channel. Yay! Kevin VDK, iPhone SE, second generation. I've been dragging my feet <laughs> for the iPhone SE two cases. But, all right, guys. Um, three more questions. Philip's got one, two more questions. What do you think about toughest iPhone? Yeah, I did a full video about that. It's full lab for now. Has Rhino should release the screen protector review a while back? Yes. So they have it back in stock. Um, I think beginning of next week. So I'll drop the review of it next week. Do you think the big iMacs are going to stay? Absolutely. Giant screens are awesome. What cases am I using currently? This one. Christine Ramsey, I love your videos, very informative. I know you're not a fan of waterproof cases, however, it's necessary. Um, I've been dragging my feet with the uh, waterproof cases. Coming out of the uh, top 10 or the isolation video series, I will do the best waterproof cases. There's only actually three that exist anymore. Um, Christine, if you absolutely need a case, the Catalyst one is the better one. Uh, from my perspective, the hit case... Hit cases lineup. Uh, I think the hit case shield is also a very good choice. Uh, what watch? That's one of the legend. Uh, do you do you have the whole Apple ecosystem? Yeah, no, I have the whole Apple ecosystem. All right, Philip. No, I've not received my Rebel cases. Michelle, Monty, say hi. Say hi to Michelle. Say hi to Michelle. All right, guys. Um, that's kind of all I got for this live stream. 
Again, I'll do this every single Friday. Um, kind of, I was a little late on it today, so I do apologize, but that's kind of uh, what we're doing. Next week, I've got the uh, Rhino Shield thing planned. And apart from that, I have to do the, the Sincipia one. Um, I really wanted to do for this because I've been seeing way too many uh, advertisements for Pella. Um, I don't actually know what else. Like, it's just been Val, my helper, she went on uh, vacation this week. So it was, it's literally just been me producing content every single day. So it's just been rough that way. And I honestly wanted to call it quits at 100 videos. Um, but 120, it almost seems trivial. But then at the same time, when you're doing a workout that has seven rounds <clears throat> and, you know, two dozen movements each round, that seems trivial as well. So I'm just like mentally, I'm just like, I'm just going to grind it out. Uh, <coughs> so Christine, if you absolutely have to, just get a life proof case. Like, it is an average case. It'll get the job done. If you can get it on Amazon, go get a uh, Catalyst waterproof one. Um, it's about the same price. And if you're on a budget, the Ghost Technautical isn't bad either. In fact, get the Ghost Technautical over the life proof free. Okay. See you guys later.